Hi, I'm Nia Peters, and today we're going to inflate a balloon using science. What you'll need is a clear plastic water bottle, vinegar, about a cup's worth, a funnel, a balloon, and about a teaspoon of baking soda. What you're going to do first is take your vinegar and your plastic bottle and pour the vinegar into the bottle. You're going to want to do this pretty confidently so you don't spill any. If you are worried about spilling, you can do this over a towel or a sink or have a parent help. And just like that, all our vinegar is in the bottle. And now we're going to put that aside. Next, you're going to take your balloon and your funnel and put the balloon around the funnel, like so. And then we're going to take our baking soda and put about a teaspoon of baking soda into the balloon. All right, and now you're gonna tap your funnel to make sure all the baking soda gets in there and carefully remove the funnel. Put that aside. And next, you're gonna pinch the bottom of your balloon so you don't have any baking soda escape and put the edge of your balloon very carefully over the edge of the water bottle. Oops, gotta be careful so you don't knock over the, the water bottle or spill any baking soda out of the balloon. All right, perfect. Now that's on there, you're gonna take the edge of the balloon and turn it upright. And now you let the science happen. And as you can see, the balloon is starting to inflate as the baking soda and vinegar mix. What's happening here is the baking soda and vinegar are having a chemical reaction. And that chemical reaction is releasing a gas, carbon dioxide. That's what all these bubbles and fizzies are. And all that gas is now in this area that's connected to the balloon. So the gas with nowhere to go goes into the balloon and inflates it like so. And that is all there is to it.